Hello everybody and welcome back to another modded character showcase. We're looking at Joseph once again here and we're jumping in to see what we can do with him. This guy of course is the character that can absorb cards to gain benefits. I'm imagining the hanged man will just give us permanent flight which is pretty good. We can go straight in here with that actually. Um, and we can create another card. The moon card? I don't know what the moon card will do if we absorb it. Um, but the Emperor, okay, I'll take, I'll take the play because that's pretty good. The Emperor, I think I'll take, um, I think I'm going to do this first. I'm going to pop this. Good stuff. Um, and then we'll head back and grab the Emperor card again here, which I realize is going to take some damage for, but I think it's fine. Emperor card will grab the Emperor card. It's pretty interesting here. So if we use the Emperor card and suck it up before the boss fight, we'll then get there's options in the boss and get a few options of things to pick through. Now, I've had a few talks with the developer of this mod after the first episode, and they have said they're going to take some suggestions on board. Of course, this character is still unreleased, so they haven't been implemented yet. But for example, when the cards are on the floor, they'll have EID descriptions letting you know what they'll do when absorbed, which is really nice. And also reverse cards and a few modded cards will get some um, some abilities, which I'm really looking forward to, especially the reverse cards. Um, we were theory crafting a few ideas for what some of the reverse cards can do, and there's been some very interesting ideas thrown out. Um, some of the reverse cards seem like they could be pretty run defining um, and, and, and pretty pretty intriguing, which I'm, I'm, I'm quite excited for. And this character just has so much potential for um, some interesting things to sort of happen. Uh, with some of the cards that I'm, I'm really intrigued to see what ends up happening with all of the reverse cards because there's quite a few weird ones out there and obviously there's a few modded tarot cards now not every card is going to get a, a modded effect only the tarot cards okay this is kind of bs this is kind of bs because I, I i destroy him and then he spits out a bunch of fires that i can't shoot through yeah this is well annoying <laughs> How am I meant to kill this guy? <laughs> there you go. I had to use a bomb. In the end, I had to use a bomb. Very good item there that's going to give us a lot of HP to work with. Uh, we'll pop another card here and see what we get. We get a devil card. So I think what we'll do here is we'll pop the devil card normally. Which I think devil devil card will give us a damage bonus permanently. So may maybe actually what I'll do is I'll, I'll drop the devil card on the floor. Leave that there. And then we'll absorb our emperor here. And that will give us, as long as we don't lose it during this fight, that will then give us double um, boss items to choose from, which is obviously rather nice. As long as we can stay alive. And not take damage. Taking damage is a one-third chance for your, uh, for your card to be removed from being absorbed, by the way. So it's not every single time you get hit, but there's always a chance when you do get hit that you could lose it. So you've got to be careful. I'm going to bomb him just to speed this up a little bit. It's taking a little while with our lowered stats. Of course, this character, as you can see, doesn't start with great stats. But here we go. We should get two items to choose from. Great. And we do get the multi-capsule for some extra stats. Uh, honestly, the fire rate and the speed are very, very nice. And then we can come and we can grab our devil card here and take that along with us. Now, we could keep the emperor going and get another doubled boss item um, if we if we would like to. So that's kind of on my mind at the moment as a decent idea. But at the same time, the devil card would help us get to the boss a little quicker, which would be kind of nice. So I'm also tempted to just do that. But I'm going to hold off for now and I'm going to try and go straight for the boss and keep our emperor and see what other cards we get along the way. At the minute, really wishing I'd have, uh, I'd have kept my Hanged Man card. That would have made this a hell of a lot less tedious, which would have been lovely. But we'll uh, we'll just do what it asks of us right now and carry on. But yeah, I am, I am definitely feeling better today. I've been a little under the weather over the past few days, but today seems to be the the, the day where I'm, I'm back to tip top, or at least nearly. I, th I still think I'm a little snivelly, but for the most part, I'm back to tip top. Okay, let's... Take this guy out before he summons too much shit. Ah, oh, there's our Emperor card gone. But that does mean we can now absorb this and get some good benefits out of it. You're going to have to die though, my good sir. Thank you. But now we've got our Emperor card, go um, Emperor card gone. We can't use that. But Devil card, plus two damage um, until we lose it is really, really nice. Um, I can imagine that going taking us quite far, early on at least. It's one of those cards where I think late game might not matter so much, but early game... It's pretty goddamn valuable to get a pretty pretty huge damage up. And we did get another Emperor, so we can actually swap that out later on 
when it comes to the boss fight. We can, in fact, I think what we can do is we can play the vast majority of the fight with higher damage and swap to the Emperor right near the end um, in order to... Ooh, that was very close. Unfortunately, I'm actually nearly dead. <laughs> I didn't realize how close to death I was. So let's 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 be a little careful here. Let's be a little, a little cautious. Unfortunately, with this character, I seem to play pretty badly on average. We'll get some hearts here, won't we? We got a burn heart at least. That's something. Um, I'll play you. Not bad, not bad. Not what I was expecting to get from you, but do not mind if I do. Don't take away my devil card, please. I would very much like to keep it. I'm liking having the uh, the flies for my rotten heart as well. That's nice. Fortune cookie, unfortunately, isn't amazing for us. Um, because, uh, to, to be fair, though, it can give us tarot cards. But it's just a less reliable way of getting tarot cards. So it's kind of iffy. It's, it's, it's one of those items that I think... Overall, it's probably a good take, but I don't... It doesn't completely remove the gimmick of his character, because his character does start with starter deck. But I'd still rather not remove the gimmick with uh, with our deck of cards, to be honest. Right, let's go do our boss. Health isn't great, but we do have a buffer, so we can't get insta-killed because of our uh, burn heart here. So we've got something going for us, at least. And like I said, I think what we're going to do is try and get through most of the fight, and then use our Emperor card, absorb it right near the end of the fight to get the extra item choice. And that's the best way to go about this. Also, it depends on how difficult our boss ends up being. Right, not too bad. Got an itchy face. No. Yeah, that was good. Managed to take out all the little weedy boys. Dude, no. I lost my devil card. And I also got hit, which is just not good for us here. I, I really don't like the situation the game's putting me in here. Right, we got our Emperor card sucked up. Give me that health before I die, thank you. <sighs> Just die already, you stupid. My god. There you go, we get our choice. And of course, we'll be taking the damage, thank you, because we need it pretty badly. It's not a lot of damage, mind you, but we do get a half black heart out of it as well, which is not bad. And we continue on. Not not bad, not bad usage of our cards so far. I think we've we've made some good use of the Emperor cards. It's always good. The good thing as well, obviously, we can use the cards normally too. We don't have to use them in this way. Death card, I'm actually unsure how that works. I'm gonna suck that up in a combat room and see if it does anything. I'm unsure what this will be. If I was to, if I was to be a guessing man, I would think that it's um, damage, like uh, room damage on hit. But I'm not entirely sure. Oh no, there you go. Okay, it was. Oh, it just gives us dry baby. I see. Okay, this is just dry baby. That's that's kind of good. We like dry baby. We do not mind the driest of boys. Um. Game is really, really not not being very kind to us right now with the uh, with the old item rooms. We got a good item room right off the bat, but now it's like, hey, wouldn't it be fun if you didn't get any items you could take? <laughs> no, it wouldn't, game. No, it wouldn't. That's a bit rude. We're kind of annoying on that front. I don't don't know why the game has such an affinity for giving active items when you already have one that you definitely want to keep. It seems to be a mainstay of Isaac and one of the worst parts of Isaac's design, in my opinion. It's it's super frustrating. It can easily kill a run if you just keep getting active items. But, I do like having Dry Baby for now. He's, uh, he's a chill guy. Unfortunately, not finding many Red Hearts, because Red Hearts are also Soul Hearts. So I'd like to be finding a couple of those to help us out, but at the moment the game isn't doing a good job of that. But we did just get that. The tower, we definitely don't want because the tower is just literally cast the tower on hit. We, we really don't need that in any way, shape, or form. I will, however, use the tower in my boss room to get a kill, maybe. We'll see if it works out for us. Just go straight ahead and do it. Didn't get us a kill, but it got mighty close. We 
got mighty close indeed. Darkness befalls us, but we're good. Did get ourselves an angel deal. Dice Goblin's kind of interesting as well here. Um, I think I will, if I drop my trinket. Eh, none of those were really great. Immaculate Heart's pretty good though, we like that, we like that. Immaculate Heart's a bit of damage, your HP up and stuff, that's good. We've seen our item room, uh, I think we're good to go on this floor. Oh, actually, to be fair, no. Let's, let's try and get a... Okay, maybe not. <laughs> I was gonna say let's try and get an extra charge here, but no. We did get some contraband though, that was a good, a good reason to go in there, nice. I guess we could play out, um, play out this guy as well, why not? See what the ferryman can give us here. It's kind of costly, but if we can manage to make the ferryman work, then it's a pretty decent, uh, pretty decent bit of loot we can gain, gain off this guy. And I don't know if each of these portals counts as a room, so I don't know if we'll get like a, a charge bar pair one of these. I'm not sure. What? These guys just aren't dying. They're just not dying. Oh my god, I've got like such low damage. Don't touch that little baby. My god, my damage sucks so bad. Cool. R why am I getting so many half red hearts? Give me a full red heart for once, please. Um, Cold is potentially pretty good in here. What? Uh, last time when he was like that, he couldn't die. This time he died instantly, so that's, that's fun. We are getting charges for this at least, which is nice. Yeah. Was never gonna happen. Was never gonna happen. Those those bloody things are terrible. This was not worth 10 cent thus far at all. Had damage. Oh my god, it's... These rooms suck, man. This is gross. These are like the most evil rooms I've ever seen when doing the goddamn ferryman. And I damage, man. I damage is so poo-poo. <laughs> I kind of don't think this guy should start with as low stats as he does. It's It's... It's kind of very gross. My damage just feels so unbelievably poo-poo. It's also because I'm just getting not great items, but this is just... Ugh. For the items that I do have, I feel like I should feel stronger than I am. And I don't. Right. Oh, there was a soul heart there that was... I completely missed. God damn it. Right, we got nothing from that. That was a whole... Waste of 10 cent, really. <laughs> I've never had three ghosts die on that thing before. That was abysmal. Right. Down we go. We got a contraband to get an item from this fella as well, which is kind of nice. And guess what, baby? It's a fucking active item. This game sucks, man. <laughs> this game. I got C-section, though. That's <laughs> unexpected. Temperance, we can do that. Mission to keep C-section alive for as long as humanly possible. Keep C-section alive for as long as possible. It will be our saviour for now. <laughs> it will be our hero, baby. My god. Dude, I can't believe we've got the item that makes all red hearts into blended hearts. And we've seen a single heart. And that single heart I missed. It's saddening. It's truly saddening. Need a better card as well. Give me a strength card, please. We, we, we desperately require it. We desperately require it. Look, half heart. Bugger off with a half hearts, man. Well annoying. Okay. Item room and shop here. Speed is nice. Stars card is really good here because this gives us a choice in our item room. We're just about to enter. Oh, it's another fucking book. No, we'll take this bad boy. Blended heart. Give me that bad boy. Strength! 
Hell yes, finally. There you go, that's some... That's some meaty damage, thank you. That's some meaty damage. We also got flight for some reason. I don't know where, where flight came from, I'll be honest. Not quite sure where the flight came from here. But I'll accept it. I'll certainly accept it. I ain't gonna turn my nose up at free flight. Good stuff. Okay, th th this runs fine now. <laughs> this runs fine. Especially now we've got a strength card in there. The strength card is great. Oh, we've lost our flight. Don't know why. Very unsure, to be honest. Very unsure. Hey, all the all the snake enemies, worm enemies, are all friendly with this uh the snake boy on our side, which is rather nice. Makes our life a lot easier. What we got here? Freezing. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, I think we'll be keeping the strength card going for a little while here. Wow, that did a lot of damage. Fool card? I don't actually know what the fool card does as a um, thingy. Maybe it just returns us to the room if we get hit or something. I'm not, I'm not sure what that would do. Spin down, though. We'll definitely be holding on to that near and dear. Okay, we finally got to the point where we've got some good health going on here. Don't even know what I did there. Oh, it's lemon mishap. <laughs> we lost our thingy, though, unfortunately. So let's let's suck up our fool card and see what happens, I guess. I'm not exactly sure what it'll do, but it's worth finding out, right? It's worth finding out. Ah, interesting. So it creates a little portal at the end of every room. I, I kind of like that. I kind of like that. So we can kind of teleport around. I do not dislike that. That's, 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 that's pretty good. I'm going to be so sad once, once we lose C-section, you know. This one's not going to feel the same. Chariot, I do not want Chariot. It's one of the cards that I, I, I don't think I'll basically ever use. I think Taurus is just a bad item. I don't want it. Oh my god, the snake boys. They're all coming in. I like the way of like jumping around. Oh my god. Didn't think I'd end up in here. Did not think I'd end up in here. Um, this one. <laughs> I was like, which portal do I go through now? What the fuck? Where's the ghost? Oh, I have the ghost, I see. We're all good. Um, I think I'm going to take the devil card here as my suck. For the extra damage, thank you. Wow! That guy just lobbed a scythe at him at fucking Mach 10. That didn't feel great. Yeah, I didn't know you could teleport into this room, that's kind of interesting. Burkano. Alright, we got some stuff. We're good to sail on out of here. Cool. Thanks for that. That was a bit strange. But what's done is done. We don't know what we're getting here, so just take it. Blood explosion. Very good. Temperance? Nah. No thank you. We've got pl plenty of money to work with here. Um, broken modem, good stuff. Options, decent. Not bad, not bad. We are in a good way right now. We are in a good way. Don't ever lose C-section and we'll be fine. Kind of forgot we had options there for a second. 
It's like, why did we get a bomb and a key? Because that's the item we just bought, you fool. Right. Hopefully we can make ourselves the right way towards the boss. Oh my god, we're getting so much money. I love having this devil card on for the extra damage right now, because we really do need it. Even with C-section, our damage is still pretty pathetic. Blood Splosion doing some interesting stuff for us here. No, my devil card! I was just saying how much I needed that. How dare you take it from me? Such a big damage down. Hermit! Hermit's decent for the shop. I'll take it. What we got going on in here? Hmm, that's kind of useless. Dude, where is the boss, man? Where is the boss? We've been almost everywhere. So many worm boys. I wonder, does, are we summoning the, the worm boys as friends randomly? Or is it just converting those that we, um... Is it just converting those that we find in rooms into our friends? Or is it summoning them per room sort of thing? I don't know. I don't remember how it works. Thank you. Right, near the boss now at least. I mean, I'm hoping we are. Ow. Like, oh, I think I walked into the spike rock there. Plague of Decay. Plague of Decay is not bad for us here. Hierophant, I'm actually kind of intrigued to see how Hierophant works as a sucked up card, to be honest. I'm, I don't know how that would work. I've not actually had Hierophant before. Normally it's two soul hearts, right? So maybe it's just more soul hearts. Maybe it gives you like the mitre effects. But at the same time, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but the, the, we have to strength it. The strength is too good. The extra damage just means too much. Right, now it's your turn, big boy. You will be forever C-sectioned. Good stuff. Synth oil, actual damage, lovely. Soul bond, no thank you. I will spin this down and hope it's something good. No! No! No, I lost C-section! <laughs> Devastation. Devastation right now. We are so sad. Cherub. Death's touch, that's what I was looking for, baby. Harlequin, baby. A reroll. Good stuff. Okay. We are out. Very interesting run thus far. Very interesting indeed. Let's keep it moving on though. Yeah, having having a bit of piercing and stuff now. We've still got strength in our in our back pocket, which is real nice. The fool. Fool's a really interesting one, but it's just th this is this is one sort of potential problem of the character. If you don't get hit, you never have to switch cards. But that's 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 why the the idea of having it one third chance on hit to lose the card you have sucked because I think it forces players to change what they do and not just take a strength card and use it all game sort of thing, which is a really good thing. I think it's well, very well designed. Um. But at the minute, I'm very much just going to keep my strength card going and not <laughs> not engage with anything else because I need damage. If I had better damage, I wouldn't need it. But to be fair, my damage is pretty good now. It's not as bad as it was. Backstab, pretty good stuff. Ooh, we should probably play you. See what you want to give us. Obviously don't want Eve Lucky Bed, but he could move that. Oh my lord. My man. Wait, what? Oh, because we got a strength card on at the minute. It gives us barely any damage. I was like, why'd they give us nothing? It's because we got a strength card. But that does mean that we no longer need our strength card. So let's suck this up and we'll lose like barely any damage. There you go, look. High Priestess. Do you know what? High Priestess is fucking amazing. It's scary, but it's a fun one. Basically, you get one foot stomp per room. Uh, now that foot stomp can deal damage to you as well. So... 
still a little sketchy, but one foot stomp per room is ludicrously strong in terms of the amount of damage output because it's got wide radius. It can one shot some bosses. It's it's real good. It's one of those high risk ones. High risk sucks that I think is actually really valuable. But yeah, I definitely think there's a few of the a few of the suck cards that need reworking. I think chariot chariot should change. <laughs> I'd rather it be like, you get like two seconds of chariot card at the start of every room, rather than it being, you get, um, you get Taurus, because Taurus is just not a fun item, unless you have really high speed. Oh, but if you have too high speed, then it's also not a fun item. It's one of those items that it's hard for it to be good in any sense of the word, so. That's, I think about reworking that, but look at that, look at that damage, baby. Strength. Double strength there. You're dead. Dude, my, my, it must be summoning snake uh, worms, because I'm getting so many of them, and they are doing bits right now. Hierophant. We still don't really know what the Hierophant does. I can't remember what card we got locked in at the moment. I'll just pop the hero font for the extra. Do the half black heart ones not work or something? Thank you, foot. Deaded. Thank you again, foot. Blood explosion for the win as well. My god. So good. Ow. Oh no. Mum's foot on uh, on mum. Not ideal. That's all we have sucked right now. We have mum's foot, don't we, course? Right, Angel Deal. It's gonna be Polaris. Polaris is decent, we'll take Polaris. Probably should have rerolled the um the key piece to be honest, but Oh, well, I guess we'll save it for another time. That was two feet. Ow. We got a spin down dice in here. Empress. We do have another spin down in here. There you go. Room done. Black heart there. Lovely. Most rooms are just like game over, dude. Not that we need the money, but goddamn, that's lucky. We're gonna get Brimstone soon as well. With Polaris. We've got 2020 at the minute, and then next we get a, a decent damager. And then after that, we get Brimstone. So now we've got the damage up. Dude, that's a very decent damager. Kind of rather not lose that, to be honest. I'd like to keep it. Hehehe. <laughs> Room instantly destroyed by foot. Got another high priestess. We'll keep that there so we know where it is. I'm about to get Brimstone any second now, I think. So wires. There we go. Brimstone is here. Unfortunately, we lose a lot of damage. I think the damage is honestly better than Brimstone in this case. Thank you for Brimstone nonetheless, I guess. Don't be like that, dude. Don't be like that. Just pop your head up. There you go. You know you're dying. Just accept your fate, please. Ow. Let's re-roll, see what we get. Six. Um, I think I take that.
Empress kind of nice here. I'll, I'll take the Empress. Some extra stats there. And I think I'll spin this down into the spiky block, why not? Right. Keep it moving. Right, we're back to regular tiers now. We've got the Empress locked in at the moment, so we've got some extra stats from that. I'm especially liking the extra speed. Yeah, we're able to pick up those half black hearts, but they don't actually do anything for us. The Polaris levels up way too fast as well, that's another thing. Ooh, hello, this is this could be fun. Not exactly what I was expecting, but thank you. We're, just, we're Gimpy as well, actually. I like Gimpy. I'm glad I didn't take away my Snake Boy. I like my Snake Boy. He has been there through thick and thin for me. Ah, I missed my feet. Honestly, I think I think High Priestess might be one of the best ones you can get. Angel. It's dangerous, but dude, is it fucking strong. Ow. I don't even know what just happened there. You see how much fucking HP we got? This item's wild. Hey, didn't even get to do your final phase. Gotta love that. Eh, hey, why not? <laughs> why not? Not really what I was looking for, but I'll take it. Weird and wacky runs as um as good old Joe. I mean, the damage output is pretty ludicrous. Moon? I've not- have I done Moon before? I don't know what Moon does. Maybe it's something to do with going into your secret room. Ah, oh, it is. Nice. It's, um, it's Luna. Pretty nice. I like that. That's good. I like that quite a bit. Alright, we are. Demolishing everything right now. I think we should have pretty much no problem at all with our boss. Broken Murdom's also really helpful too here. Got the world. I'm just gonna pop the world. Helps us find the boss. What what what, what what's going on with you guys? Is there any is there any need for this? It's just a time waster, right? Thrilling gameplay, my guy. Thrilling gameplay. This is really good with um with the, the beams that are coming out of us. Cool. We got him. Right, boss time. Well, boss time, last floor time, should I say. It's been a fun run. I think we've utilized this character quite a lot. Don't think kamikaze is the way to go for us, though. Good, good. Little monstro. Should be getting quite a lot of chests here. From our um, extra options thing. Oh my god, yes. Polaris went wild there. Emperor doesn't do anything for us this late in the game. We good? We are good. We do have flight as well, so we can just scoot over. Yeah, look, you see that there? I picked up the half red, half black heart, and it didn't give me a red or a black heart. Or even a soul heart. It gave me nothing. Seems a bit crummy. Bit of a bad deal. I'm just going to keep plowing through here and hope for the best. Oh, wait, you're unkillable until we uh, kill this guy, I think. Good. 
Oh, 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 what's this? What's this? What's this? Wow, I picked up the heart by accident. Options, how do you how you portray me, sir? Oh, we got Brimstone going. I always forget this is how Brimstone works with this now. It's very cool. I wonder what this bit's over. Look, look at this Brimstone right here at this wall. Look. Like a random Brimstone of the wall. Looks like we're going the right way. But I'm very unsure. No, I lost my Brimstone. How dare you? Justice? I don't know how justice works. Wild this. Where the hell's the boss, man? <laughs> this is... Okay, here it is. We found it. Fortunately, I've already got flights. That doesn't mean much to us. Right. Should have had an easy time killing these. Although, actually, thinking about it, I don't know if I'm going to live here. I'll try my best, but I've just realised my health is not pretty good and I only have rotten hearts left, so... Could end up losing this pretty easily. Oh no, my card. Don't move, you dick. No, I died. I've got revive this. Okay, it's okay. No, it revives me outside the room. Are you kidding? I had this bottle here the whole time. Okay, we're, we're definitely burned here. I tried my best, people. I tried my best. Okay, no, doesn't matter. We won anyways. <laughs> there you go, people. Hope you guys did enjoy that one. That was a lot of fun. I'll see you guys in the next one.